of high stakes, where every decision is a gamble and every move can be your last. High Rollers! And now, here's your host, Brandon Scruggs! Hello, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome into another edition of High Rollers right here at MVG Productions. Glad you could join us here once again. Well, we have a champion right now who is trying to retire himself into the Tournament of Champions if he can get through today's episode still a champion. Let's meet him now. Currently, with three wins under his belt and $292,564 cash and prices to his record, please welcome back Mr. Tim McClellan. Hey, yeah, how are we doing today, Tim? Yeah, doing all right. How about you? I cannot complain, sir. I mean, th times are dire, but things can be a whole lot worse at this point. So, Yeah, we're just here trying to spread some love here, everybody. Absolutely. Well, have you given any consideration what you're going to do with any of your winnings so far? Pay off debts. No kidding. Well, you got a tall task in order today, but you're a very good player, and we're going to see how well you do if you can make it into that Tournament of Champions through a good game here today. So let's meet your opponent here on this game of High Rollers in our first matchup today. A newcomer here to MVG Productions, but a longtime friend going back to my old days on blog TV. Please welcome in Lou. Thank you. Thank you. It's actually genuinely been a long time since I've talked to you, Lou. How are things down in your part of the world? I'm trying to stay safe, but doing okay. Fantastic. Well, tell the good folks at home a little bit about yourself, sir, if you don't mind. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'm 49 years old. Uh, no kids. Uh, I work for Unifirst, and uh, I'm here trying to make some money. Fantastic. Well, glad to have you aboard here. Hopefully things go really well for you today. Good luck to you both here. Let's get started with our game of high rollers here by looking at our prizes we're going to be playing with in our first game here. Starting with column number one in this one, we have that cash prize of $15,000, along with a two-carat diamond ring, a barbecue island, a game room, and finally a trip to Amsterdam. So a fully loaded column in column one for this game so far. Total total the total for that one is $44,311 there. In column number two, we have a European vacation, along with a trip to Myrtle Beach. We have a Bora Bora cruise and some exercise equipment. And those four prizes combined for a total of $47,690 there. And finally, in column three, we have a trip to the Amazon, along with a trip to the next year's Oscars and a motorcycle. And those three prizes combined for a total of $60,676 and a board value in game number one of $152,677. Lots, lots of prizes to be won. Almost a fully loaded board already to kick off this episode. All we need now is the numbers, so let's line them up. And it looks like column number two is going to be our hot column for this game, players. A roll of ten will eliminate that thir uh, eliminate that second column, and we'll also pick up our hot column bonus of five thousand dollars if you can eliminate all three of those numbers at the same time. All right, uh, Tim, you are the champion. Of course, you'll be buzzing in with the Z key. Lou, you are a challenger. You're going to be buzzing in with the M key. As of, as always, I'll be reading you a true or false statement. If you think you know the answer, buzz in. If you're right, you get control of the dice. If you're wrong, your opponent will get control, where you'll have the option to either pass or play. Okay? So with that said, hands on your buzzers, players, and here comes your first statement on this episode of High Rollers. We begin with this. The Firebird was a car built by Chevrolet. And that's Tim. I think that was false. Yeah, it was built by Pontiac. Oh, You're absolutely right, sir. All right, all rolls are good for this opening roll, so go ahead. Good luck. All right, I want to see double fives to get rid of that middle column here. Let's do it. And we start you. It's a double. So that's, that gives you an insurance marker, which will help you out for the game. You got a double threes for a six. Uh, give me the one, two, three. The old one, two, three combo comes off the board. Hot column out of play, but now a roll of six will get you that second column here. All right, next statement. The Charleston 
is a kind of hat. Lou. False. Yeah, it's a famous dance. You're right. All right, bad roll is a three, sir. You have the option. Play it or pass? Roll. Gonna roll, all right. Rolls, and you got yourself an eight. Uh, take the eight. All right, eight the hard way comes off the board, leaving a roll of nine now to clear column number one. Next statement. In Greek mythology, a centaur is a half-human and half-lion. That's Tim. I think that's false. Yeah, it is false. It's actually half-human and half-horse. You are right, sir. All right, you've got an insurance marker. Your bad rolls are three and eight right now. Roll it or pass? Uh, looks like the odds are with me on this one. I'm going to roll. All right, take a roll. All right, go ahead. When you're ready. All right, let's see if I can get another one. And you got yourself a four. All right, I've got to knock out the four. All right, four comes off the board now. A roll of 12 now, players. will eliminate the most expensive column up there, over $60,000 in prizes. Next statement. The animated sitcom Family Guy is older than South Park. Lou. False. Yeah, it is false. South Park began in 1997. Family Guy didn't start till two years later. You're right. Option yours, sir. Bad rolls are three, four, eight, and ten. I'll roll. I'm gonna roll. All right. Good luck. Roll. Oh, it's a ten. Bad roll. I mean, Tim gets game one. All right. Good job, Tim. First game is yours. You didn't pick up any prizes, so you get the house minimum of $1,000 in cash, but no worries, Lou. It takes two games to win a match because we play best two out of three, so we'll see if you can play catch up here as we jump straight into game number two now as we add some more prizes to the board, which I think will just about fill it out, so let's take a look at them again. Column number one, fully loaded pro with $15,000 in cash, a diamond ring, a barbecue island, the game room, and of course the trip to Amsterdam, over 40,000 prizes there. And in column number two, we have a fully loaded column there, too. The European Vacation, the trip to Myrtle Beach, the Bora Bora Cruise, the exercise equipment, and, of course, the motor scooter. Fully loaded column there. Again, over $50,000 in prizes now. And finally, we'll add another prize to column number three to go with that trip to the Amazon, the trip to the Oscars, a motorcycle, and the bed. we added bedroom group to that column there. Those four prizes combined for a total of 65213 and a board value in this game of $160,313. So some good money on the line here. All we need now is some more numbers. Let's add them, line them up. And it looks like it's going to be column number three this time. Most expensive column on the board, players. A roll of 12 this time will get you all the prizes in that column plus the $5,000 bonus. So most importantly, an insurance marker to go with it. So hopefully one of you guys can do it. Uh, Tim's looking for, to win the game in the match here. Lou trying to play catch up. Here's your first statement. There are 306 bones in an adult human's body. That's Lou. False? Yeah, it's 206. You're right. You got the dice, sir. All rolls are good. That's a double. All right. Insurance marker for you. It's going to help you out. You've got yourself a six. How would you like to play it? We'll go 5-1. Uh, 5-1 one. One combo comes off the board. All right. And here we are. All rolls still good. Next statement. In judo, beginning students wear a white belt. That's Tim. Uh, I'm going to say false. No, that's actually true. They do wear what belt. Uh, Lou, you got to control the dice again, sir. All rolls are still good. And you got yourself a seven. A seven? All right, seven the hard way comes off the board. A roll of five now will get you that third column. Hot column bonus out of play now. Former model Carla Bruni is married to former French president Nicolas Sarkozy. Lou. False. No, that is true. Oh. All right, Tim, you got the dice on this one. All rolls still good. All right, I'm going to go ahead and take it. Let me see a double here. Got yourself a five. 
Well, I can get the three and the two. Three and the two come off the board, and you pick up column number three. All right, those well, $65,000 in prizes go to your side, but again, they're only yours if you can win the game. All right, Luke can still catch up. Here's your next statement. Batman is the secret identity of Clark Kent. Tim. False. Yeah, we know. It's Bruce Wayne. You're right, sir. All right, good rolls. Four, six, eight, nine, ten, and twelve. I think I'm going to pass. All right, going to Lou. Lou, you've got two shots to roll any of those numbers, sir, because you have an insurance marker. <laughs> and you have another one with another double pair of fours. You've got an eight now. Take that eight. All right, eight comes off the board, leaving a roll of six now oh, oh, for that second column here. Here we go. Here's your next statement. IKEA is a Swedish company. That's Lou. Balls? No, they are Swedish. That's true, sir. All right, Tim, ball's back in your court, sir. Good rolls. Four, six, nine, and ten. Roll it or pass. Uh, I'm going to make him work for it. All right. I'm going to pass. All right, Lou, three chances. You need a four, six, oh, nine, or ten. Six, nine, or four. Six, nine, or four. Come on. Five. That's a bad roll. So I'm going to take one of your two insurance markers and ask you to roll again. Six on four, six on four. Eleven. Another oh, bad no. roll. So I gotta take this oh, other no. shirts marker from you. You need to roll oh. a four, six, nine, or ten to stay in the game. Otherwise, Tim will get his fourth Come win on. as champion. Come on. Oh, five's a bad oh. roll. That means Tim is still our champion. God. Oh. Oh. You good, man. GG, oh, G2, GG. Well done, well done, mm -hmm. sir. Picked up some prizes there. Uh, we'll talk to you in just a second, Tim. Lou, you played a very good game, sir. Just unfortunately, the dice were not rolling in your favor. But did you have fun with us, sir? Yes, I did. And unfortunately, I didn't win, but I did have fun. Oh, good. I'm glad you enjoyed your time here. You're not going to live here empty-handed. We got $500 in consolation along with some nice parting gifts for you. And we'll hopefully have you back for more games in the future, all right? Thank you. All right. Well done for you, sir. And Tim, a nice win there for you. $66,213 in cash and prizes. When we add in your initial winnings from previous, you're now up to a grand total of $358,777 cash and prizes. Will he be able to add another $25,000 and possibly another new car? We'll find out as he takes on the big numbers right after this. Stay with us. Back here at High Rollers, Tim with over $350,000 in cash and prizes now, and he's going to get his shot to play the big numbers here for another $25,000 and possibly a new car, sir. As you know, each number you get rid of in the big numbers is worth $250 to you. Get rid of all nine, that's another $25,000 in your pocket, along with a brand new car. <coughs> now, what car you play for, it's all up to you. Each of the big numbers has a car associated with it. Pick one, let's see what you'll be driving with, playing for. Who won number six? Uh, uh, first thing I thought of was number five. Number five. So should you beat the big numbers, you'll not only win 25000 in cash, you'll be driving away in a brand new Ford Ooh. Mustang worth $24,500. It's almost a $50,000 prize package for you, sir, if you can beat the big numbers. There's the magical golden dice. Remember, every double that you get it will get you an insurance marker to help you win the big numbers round. So when you're ready, best of luck to you. Let's play the big numbers. Here we go. All right. I don't want to see some doubles here, so let's get this thing going. First roll for you is the five. How appropriate. All right. Let's get rid of the five. All right. Single five comes off the board. You've got $250. Roll it again. All right. Get some doubles here. Come on. You got yourself an 11. Uh, let's get rid of the eight and the three. Eight and three come off, right? Good combination there. You're up to $750. All rolls still good. Oh, I want to get some doubles here. Come on, let's go. And that's going to be an eight. Uh, seven and one. 
All right, seven and one come off the board. Get rid of the one early. You're up to twelve hundred fifty dollars. You have the two, four, six, and nine remaining. All right, we're gonna have some good numbers here. Let's get some doubles. Let's go. You got yourself a ten. Uh, the only way to do it is six and four. All right, the six and the four both come off the board. That brings you up to fifteen hundred dollars, I think. Yeah, no, seventeen fifty. Excuse me, that's seventeen fifty for you. You have the two and the nine remaining, so that means your good rolls two, nine, and at a world eleven will get you the cash and car. All right, let's get go eleven. Come on, give me eleven. Oh, Ten oh, missed it oh, by a oh, dot. Oh, 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 rough boy. going, oh. sir. <laughs> that sucks. Hey, but don't yeah. feel bad about it, sir. Seven numbers off the board get you another $1,750 in winnings. And then when we add in your previous winnings here of three of $358,777. You now have four game cash prizes totaling $360,527. Right. Tim, I hope you retire after the next game. That's bad. We'll see what happens. Tim's got four wins in a row. Will he make it to the magical number five and retire as our first undefeated champion of the season? We'll find out as he takes on his last his hopefully his last opponent right after this short commercial timeout. More high rollers after this. Sam, I believe in you. I totally believe in you. Welcome back to High Rollers here. Tim going for retirement here in his fifth and hopefully final game here as he takes on his next opponent. Coming to us by way of the great state of Minnesota, we have Mr. Nell Snezrod. Woo! Yeah! Ladies and gentlemen, he is his own biggest fan right here. Never going to lie. Boo, boo. Yeah, boo. I, knew that. I knew it was coming. Anyway, good to have you back, Nels. So how have you been? Thank you. Thank you for having me. Yeah, well, you've, you've always say you like putting um, putting people's runs as champion to an end. Do you think you have what it takes to take I, down Tim? I think Tim I have here? what it takes to end Tim's right here. Well, no, we... You well, uh, we shall more. see. Remind, yeah. remind the good folks at home a little bit more about yourself. Uh, I'm started. a cashier at Target who likes to bowl. So. Fantastic. Well, glad to have yes. you aboard. Thank good luck you. to you both as we jump right into our first game of the second matchup. Here we're looking at the prizes on the board. Starting with column one, again, a fully loaded prize, fully loaded prize column there. The cash, the ring, the barbecue island, the game room, and of course the trip to Amsterdam. Oh my God. The prize package there, over $44,000. Column 2 fully loaded as well. Two great trips, one to Europe, one down to Myrtle Beach, a Bora Bora cruise to go with that, some exercise equipment, and of course the motor scooter there. That price column now, a little over $50,000. And finally in column 3, we're going to add another start with a fresh price there, an oak dresser. That's worth fifteen hundred dollars there. Total board value in this game number one, ninety-six thousand six hundred dollars. Ooh! All right, so a nice prize package up for grabs here. Let's see who can capture it as we t add the numbers to the board. Am I the G on the M? All right, and it looks like oh, no hot column Boo. bonus. All right, so no hot column bonus available Boo. for this first game here, but we'll see if you can knock out. The uh, numbers the hard way here, players. Uh, Tim, you're the champion. Of course, you buzz in with the Z. Nails, you're the challenger. You'll be buzzing in with the M, all right? Okay. We unlock the reels for our, our buzzers for our players here, and we shall get started for this game of high rollers with this first statement here. Good luck to you both. Lindsey Vaughn is an American former figure skater. Nails. As false. Yeah, she's an alpine ski racer. You are right, sir. And you can control the dice first. Let's go. You got yourself a seven. Five and two, please. Five and the two both come off the board. Leaving a roll of eight now for column one. A roll of 12 will clear column three. Next statement. The flag of the United Kingdom is called the Union Jack. Nils. True. That is a true statement. You're correct. Uh, essentially, all rolls still good, so go ahead and okay. roll. Got yourself a seven again. Uh, six and one. All right, the one and the six both come off the board. 
leaving a roll of 12 now to clear column two, and a roll of seven will clear column number one. Next statement. In the animated sitcom Futurama, Bender is a cyclopean alien. And that's Nels. True? No, it's false. You fool. He's, he's the metal bending robot. The show, so sue me. You are missing out on some good stuff there, sir. You should, you should look into it at some point. Yeah. At a time. All right, Tim, you've got control, sir. The bad rolls for you right now are five and six. You want to roll it or pass? Come on, six. I'm going to go ahead and roll. Okay. Come on, six. All right. Give me a double. Give me a good double here. Oh, oh now it's a six Nels bad roll, it. and Nels what? gets game one. And I called it two. Oh, ow. Ow. Wow. wow. The saltiness of Nels rubbed off on Tim there and giving him the first game of this matchup here. And Nels, just for the record, Bender would so fit you because his favorite quote is, bite my shiny metal ass. That's very true. Right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So, well done. Well, Nels picks up game one here, putting the Tim behind, Tim behind putting Tim behind the old eight ball here, as it were. He needs two in a row. We'll see if he can catch up. Nels has got $1,000 so far. And let's go ahead and put some more prizes on the board oh, for our second, <laughs> our second game. Again, column one, over $44,000 in prizes there with that great array of prizes there. And again, column number two, we have over $50,000 in prizes there. Two great trips, a cruise, a game room, all sorts of good, good stuff in there. Sorry, the game room is in column one. The exercise equipment and motor scooter is in column two. Apologies for that. Over $50,000 there. And now for column three, we're going to add another price. To go with the oak dressing there, we're going to add a trip to Shanghai, China worth over $12,000. So that makes that column worth $14,010 and a board value now of $109,110. Ooh, All right, wow. over a hundred nine grand up for grabs. Let's see if somebody can take home some prizes in this one as we line up the numbers. And looks like column number two is going to be our hot column this time. A roll of twelve will not only get you over fifty thousand dollars in prizes, but the hot column bonus of five thousand dollars. All right, Ooh. Tim trying to play catch up. Nails trying to dethrone our long-standing champion. We'll see how it works out. We start with this first statement. Gmail is an email service provided by Google. Nels. True. That is a true statement. You are correct. Come on. Uh, dice are yours. Get... All rolls are good. Come on. Let's get 12. That's a double. That's a 10. So you get an insurance marker. And how you want to play the 10? That's a good question. Um, five, one, and four. All right. Taking the f one, the four, and the five all come off the board. Gets rid of the hot column bonus, but a roll of six now will clear column two. A roll of 11 will clear column number three. Here we go. Next statement. The first sequel to the mobile game Candy Crush Saga was Candy Crush Donut Saga. Nels. False. Yeah, it was Soda Saga was the name of the game. You are right, sir. Only bad roll is a four, and you have an insurance marker. I'm going to play. Going to play. All right. Come on. Come on now. And you got yourself an eight. couple options six, here. Six and two. All right. The six and the two both come off the board. And that gives you column number two. Well done. $50,000 in prizes goes over to your side of the board, but again, they're only yours if you can win the round here. A roll of nine now will clear column number three. Tim, you've got to get control here, see if you can jump in here. Here's your next statement. The chemical symbol of gold is G-O. Nels. False. Yeah, it's actually A-U, Latin for arum. You are correct. All right, good. Uh, bad rolls are four, five, and six. Would you like to roll or pass? I'm going to pass. All right. Pass. Tim, over to you, sir. You need uh -huh. anything above a seven, you're in good shape here. A nine or a double, like, 12 or something would really be helpful for you. All right. Yes, I'm good. Got a 10. Ooh. Okay, seven, three. Seven and three. Tech comes off the board. You're still alive. <laughs> a roll of eight and a nine 
are all that's left on the board, players, so control, very important here. Here is your next statement. In traditional lore, Santa Claus's sleigh is red, is led. Tim. I'm going to say true. Is led by 12 reindeer. That is actually false. <laughs> yeah, jumped ahead into the buzzer there. Didn't let me finish. It's only eight. Nails, obviously going for the going for the kill shot here if he can get it. Tim, you must roll an eight or a nine to stay alive. Otherwise, we are going to have ourselves a new champion. Come on, Cowboys. Well, nine. It's been, it's been Shut up, Travis. Good. I'll see you in the tournament. Shut up, Tit Munch. Come on, Tim. It's a five. Bad roll, and Nails is our new champion. The salt water! Damn it. Nope. There you go, Dallas. Sir, congratulations to you, Thank Nails. You. We'll talk Thank to you. you in just a second here. Tim, you have been an outstanding and very fine champion here, sir. You cannot be disappointed in your performance at all here on the show. I mean, through through the four wins that you had, you may not have a guaranteed seat in the tournament, but as of right now, as the filming of this episode, you are top of our leaderboard, so you're the number one seed right now with your four wins, and you're taking home with you $360,527 in cash and prices. So well done. A round of applause for Mr. Tim Cleland, folks. Good job, Tim. We're not worried to have your money. Well, hopefully we'll, you'll get another chance to maybe retire before the season's over with. We'll bring you back at a later date, all right? Okay. And Tim and Nels, you've done it. You've, man yeah. you've managed to pull it off, sir. You are the new champion. You've got yourself $51,789 in cash and prizes so far. We're going to see if you can add another $25,000 and possibly a brand new car to that as you play the big numbers. We'll do that next. Here on High Roll Statements. Welcome back to High Rollers here. Nels is our new champion so far over with a nice win, taking down T Tim over $50,000 in prizes. And now, Nels, you get your shot at the big numbers here, sir. As you know, each number you can remove off the big board here is worth $250. Get rid of all nine. It's worth $25,000 and a car of your choice. Which car would you like? Let's go number two, please. Number two. Should you manage to beat the big numbers, you'll be driving away in a brand new... Honda Element worth sixteen thousand dollars. All right, so a forty-one thousand dollar prize package up for grabs for you, sir. There's the magical golden dice. When you are ready, start rolling. Good luck. Let's get some numbers. Start you off with an eight. Take the eight off. All right, big eight comes off. You got two hundred fifty dollars. Roll again. Come on, come on. That's a double. There we go. That's helpful there. Gives you an insurance mark. Please. The hard fork comes off the board. You double up to five hundred dollars. All rolls still good. Come on, no, no, no double be nice. Well, asking you shall receive. You got it. Double threes for six. Five and the one, please, sir. Five and the one. Getting rid of that pesky one early on. Double it up again. A thousand dollars. Two insurance markers right now, sir. Only bad rolls are four. Another insurance marker. Let's come on. He sold the soul to the devil. Oh, four. That's the only bad roll up there. So I got to take one of your okay. insurance markers Ooh. back. You got one left. Go ahead and roll again. Okay, let's, take, let's get another one. Let's go. Come on. No way. Oh, uh, no way. What am I saying? No way. Hey. No fours, he says. Hey, you got yourself an 11. <coughs> There's two ways to do it. I know. Yeah. Six, three, and two. Ooh. Going the hard way with it. All right. Six, three, and two all come off the board. That gives you seven numbers now, sir. That's $1,750. You have a seven and a nine remaining. All you need to do, and you got one insurance marker left. <laughs> got a seven. Oh. All right. $2,000 now. All separates you from a car and the cash is that big number nine. You got two chances for it. Good luck. No, Go get that car, Nels. Come on, Nels. It's an eight. Mm. One short. Oh. Bad roll. We'll take that. We'll take that. Sure it's Marco oh, back. You got this, buddy. You Come must on. roll a nine Come for the prize. Doubles, my nine. Can you get doubles or nine? No. Doubles. 
It's a six. <laughs> Bad roll, but it Still keeps you alive, so it gives you another Still chance at it. it. Yeah. Two thirds of the way there. Come on, Nails. Can he do it? Can he get back to the front? Oh, oh, I hate it again oh, at the bus oh, serve. Oh. oh. Tough break, sir. But hey, not bad. Eight hey, numbers off the board. Two thousand bucks out off the big numbers there. And when we add in your previous winnings, fifty-one thousand seven hundred eighty-nine dollars. A one-game cash prize is now totaling fifty-three thousand seven hundred eighty-nine bucks. So not bad. I was close. Yeah, that you were. No wonder they call you the salt. And but, to be fair though, if you took the nine to the oh no, that is stupid. Yeah, he it wouldn't have got he wouldn't have got there because he would got rid of the eight earlier. But although he would have the, the first eight he would have rolled would have helped him out. So yeah, we wouldn't know. But for now though, nails, you are the new champion, and you'll be back with us next time to defend your yes, title I here do. on High Rollers. And folks, that is going to do it for us here on this episode. We're all out of time. We want to thank our audience here for watching thank you guys at home for watching as well remember if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet and you want to see other great game shows we've done here in the past present and future don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button down below and ring the bell that way you never miss out on all the fun and games going down here at mvg productions help me get to my 1000 subscriber goal by the end of 2020 in the meantime between time till the golden dice come rolling our way once again and we get another shot at some more prizes i'm your host brandon scruggs saying thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time right here for more high rollers take care Bye for now. Promotional consideration for high rollers paid in part by the following. Folgers, the rich dark land of Folgers coffee makes it the best part of waking up. It's Folgers in your cup. By Blistex, the moisturizers inside bring soothing relief to dry top lips. Blistex for dry lips. Juicy Juice, 100% juice for 100% kids. Now available in three new flavors, it's Juicy Juice. By Paul Mitchell, the best choice for hair care products for your hair, it's Paul Mitchell. And by Geico, 15 minutes can save you 15% more on, on your car insurance needs. This is Sunny Boy speaking for High Rollers, an FPG Productions presentation.